Okay. Can a DoorDash customer tip the Dasher on the app after delivery? Okay, I've worked for DoorDash a while. If you want some cool tips and hints on how to make some serious money delivering food, not only with DoorDash, but other delivery companies, I can help you make some serious money because I'm here to help life go right. That's right, me, right here. Okay, so this is the, the best one, is when you pull up, you deliver to the customer, they're just happy as hell, and they just love you, and it's really hard to get away, and they want to wrap with you for a little while, they're really neat people, and the orders are flying, and you already got an order that you just accepted, and you got to go, and you're trying to be nice, and they're just wonderful people, you just wish all your customers were like that, and they say, hey, I will tip you on the app. Okay, DoorDash, what's your answer? Tell me what you think the answer is. Go ahead and comment below. What is the answer to that comment when the customer says, Hey, I will leave you a big tip on the app. Okay, I'm going to give you the answer. No. N-O, no. It's not happening. Not on DoorDash. We are not Uber. They're trying to be slick. They're lying to you. It's a scam or they just don't know better. It doesn't happen that way. The only thing they can do after the order is to rate you on the app. They're sent a message and they rate you or they don't. A lot of them just won't even do it. They just ignore it, uh, which is unfortunate. Um, but the ones that, that are mad uh, will make sure to, to rate you and rate you to hell. But... Um, the, there is one option. Yes, they can tip you after you delivered, but the only way the customer can do that is to get on their app and request to talk to DoorDash immediately, a rep. If it's too busy, it's just going to tell them to leave a support ticket. Uh, so they have to type a little email there. Um, but if they can manage to get a hold of a DoorDash representative on the phone after you deliver it to them through the app, uh, they wait till DoorDash answers and they say, hey, I would like to tip this Dasher that just delivered to me. And they have to say what restaurant the food came from, the name on their account, their phone number, all that good stuff. And then they have to uh, enter a credit card over the phone and tell DoorDash how much they'd like to tip you. Okay? And guess how many people are going to do that? Mm, about negative zero. So don't fall for that when the customer says, hey, I'll tip you on the app. Because that's not happening. DoorDash doesn't have a feature like that on the food ordering app. They have a feature on tipping the dasher on the app that's when they're ordering the food, okay? And the tips have always been pooled with DoorDash to all the dashers to upgrade the prices that are paid to the dasher for deliveries. And um, so, you know, if you are delivering... A drink for the lowest order I've ever seen is two dollars, and it was for a drink from McDonald's, a flurry or some kind of thing. Um, and so the order was like five, and they were paying me two to deliver, and I was like two miles away. But um, that's usually a mistake in an order. I've sent another dasher immediately because something was missed in the order, and they've got to get that other piece of the order out there. Um, it's not a scam order. It's just there was a piece missing. A lot of people think it's a scam order right off the top, but that's not true. Um, so, uh, the best way for them to tip you, if they say, I'll tip you on the app, say DoorDash doesn't have that function on the app. You have to literally call it in. Um, say, but, you know, if you'd like to tip me, now I get double tips. Yes, I get tipped on the app, and I get tipped by the customer in person a lot of times. Um, about 80% of the time. 
because my service is exceptional. Um, and so I tell them, well, you know, uh, I've got a little bit of change on me. If they happen to have cash, 90% of the people don't. Uh, you should when you're ordering food if you're a customer. You should. Um, and uh, uh, especially with DoorDash because um, we don't see any tips till after. Right now they've redone the app too. After we've delivered that they have this breakdown and it says customer tip. And the, really the only thing I see true about customer tip is when it says zero. DoorDash isn't going to lie about that. And that really hurts. If somebody would use a luxury service to have food delivered to their work or their home or, work or on a trip or whatever to a high dollar hotel and, and they can't tip. I mean, that's just really terrible. But again, there's countries that don't believe in tipping. They don't, they don't do that. Um, you have to respect other people's education and way of life till they learn, I guess. Um, but, uh, I, normally you tip that delivery driver, period. I mean, you're so lucky in this day and age to not have to order pizza and that's all you can order for food. Uh, DoorDash is wonderful because it has high dollar restaurants, all the high end stuff. And then it has the cheap stuff that's to go, you know, your Taco Bell, your McDonald's, your Wendy's, things like this on their food ordering apps. And so you have a huge variety of types of food. Um, you don't have to just order pizza, um, like it was, you know, in the old days and pay real high delivery fee and all that kind of stuff. They have all kinds of DoorDash deals all the time. They got $9.99 unlimited deliveries per month. Um, they've got, uh, special deals by the hour. Uh, if you order at peak hours, you got to pay that peak pay, which that peak pay does go directly to the driver. But bear in mind. We're driving in traffic. We're driving in rain. We've got order upon order. We've got stacked orders. You're not the only one we're delivering for. So, you know, we're burning gas and at stoplights and everything else. Um, uh, you know, that peak pay really helps us out a lot um, because we get paid pennies to make a delivery, um, honestly, when you get done with the deductions and everything like that. And, every, you know, most of all that's tax deductible, all that stuff. Your car maintenance, your car payment, your car insurance, all kinds of stuff. Um, but uh, uh, carry a credit card reader. Change for a 20. That way you can tell the customer right there, boom, boom. You catch them right there to get that money. Just like a dancer. You say, hey, um, I've got change for 20. Or, uh, you know, if they say, oh, all I got is a credit card. Say, well, I've got a PayPal card reader. And, you know, they, they love that. Because they're like, oh my gosh, that's great. Uh, let me give you five, ten dollar tip. I get it a lot. I have a PayPal card reader and I enter on the bill a uh, uh, food delivery tip right there. Make them sign for it. And I have instant cash. That's right. I run that card right in front of their face. Type in the stuff. They read the thing. They sign for it with their finger on my phone. Boom, boom, I'm done. Okay, so... And you can get these card readers at the, uh, a lot of the office supply, the big office supply stores. You can buy a card reader. Uh, the best one is the one like I've got. It's an actual legitimate card reader thing with a battery on and everything. And I can slide the card through it, put the chip card in, lay it over the top and tap it. Um, they have little tiny triangle ones that you stick into your phone. I hate those. Um, they just have trouble uh, reading, and you get charged an extra dollar if you have to hand key the number in because the card's not reading because it's wore out. Uh, a lot of these people that have lots of money and use credit cards all the time, they wear that card out, and that strip gets ruined, and you have to hand key it in. Um, so you lose money right there. If they give you a $10 tip, and you got to pay a dollar twenty-five because you hand keyed it in to PayPal, um, you just lost money. So um, invest in a good one. Um, I bought mine directly through PayPal. I paid 150 for mine, and it's like this big. It's really nice. Um, let me whoop it out and show it to you. I keep it in a little thing. Keep it charged before every shift. See? And I can slide my card in here, tap it, uh, and and um, use a chip. Uh, it's really great. Uh, and I can do it right there. Boom, boom. I have the PayPal app on my phone, we to it together, and it's like, boom, boom, that fast. It is really, really, really nice. And um, uh, so you could catch them. If you have change for 20, and you have a card reader, 
but that's about it, other than getting a cash tip. Um, no, uh, the customer cannot tip the dasher on the app after the delivery. It's not happening. We're not Uber or anything like that. It's just DoorDash. So, not at this time. August 2019, and all the, the time that I have worked for DoorDash, that has never been an option to tip on the app after the delivery. You can tip on the app before the delivery, but there's no guarantee we get it. And I love when the customer goes, did you get the tip? <laughs> we don't even know until we slide accept. And um, like I say, they've always pulled the tips with DoorDash to every driver that's on shift throughout the United States to even out the orders to make it a little bit more tempting to accept an order. Um, and different areas pay different amounts. I've noticed that. I've, I see people that have orders that are $4. God, I just don't even want to do that order. Um, but anyway, uh, I hope that you enjoyed this vlog. And uh, go ahead and subscribe. Throw a thumbs up if you're really happy. And um, if you've got any questions pertaining to this vlog, go ahead and comment below. If it's a question for something that doesn't even pertain to this vlog, make sure to subscribe so you can have access to all my DoorDash videos because I've got lots of them and I'm sure there's one there that'll answer your question. All right. Thank you so much for watching and I hope I helped you so that you can make way more money. This is all about those tips. That's right. All right. Because I'm here to help life go right. That's right. I love you, everybody. DoorDash, delivering good. That's what we do.